Good afternoon, you're watching another episode of Phantom Flight 101. And this week's episode brings me to Little Bay Park, Queens, New York. Yes, happy anniversary. Yes, it's three years that I've been on YouTube. Three years today, I uploaded my first video. But it's a beautiful day here in New York City, Saturday. Sun shining, people are out, people are out walking, exercising, enjoying themselves, having a good time. You know, during this time of uh, the virus, it seems like they uh, put the school safety to patrol the parks, along with the parks department. But, uh, you know, like I said, people are out having a good time. No one's able to barbecue yet because, you know, barbecuing causes, you know, large gatherings and there is no gathering right now. So people got to do what they got to do. People are out, like I said, having a good time, riding bikes, walking, getting their exercise in, having a lot of fun out here. I got a Lance approval. I don't know if you've seen the bridge or not over here. But I got Lance approval to fly in this area, and the parks department said it was okay as long as I stay away from the people. So I'm about to put the bird up and get some shots. Hope you enjoy the flight. The Throg's Neck Bridge opened on January 11th, 1961. The Bronx side of the bridge passes straight through the campus of SUNY Maritime College and on the Queenside Little Bay Park. A lot of people out today, it's a beautiful day. Going up to about 80 degrees today on this Saturday day here in New York. But um, like I said, yeah, you got uh, a lot of people out here today exercising, riding bikes, people fishing, jogging, walking up and down the trail here at the park. Having a good old time here in New York City. No, no one can barbecue, you know, due to the social distancing that causes a lot of gathering barbecue. You know everybody wants to get out and get their barbecue on. But uh, in due time, in due time. Well, like I said, I'm getting some shots of the bridge. day out here in the park. The park is starting to get a little crowded. And that was my time here at Little Bay Park, and I hope you enjoyed the flight. Please feel free to check out the descriptions below, and also feel free to leave your comments. And I'll see you next time on Phantom Flight.